Firefly Kids TV. Hello guys, it's me Danish and today we are going to listen a story about a baby alligator. Before we listen to the story, like, subscribe and share this channel to your friends and family. Baby Alligator by Ginger L. Clark illustrated by Nisi Twynum. It is morning on a lake in Florida. A baby animal is crying. Cheep. 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 It sounds like a bird. But is it? No. It is a baby alligator in a nest of sticks and leaves and mud. She has cut open her soft egg. She pokes out her head. She blinks her big, black eyes. All around her, other baby alligators break out of their shells, too. It is a big family. As many as 40 babies are born at one time all from the same mother. The baby alligator is only about 9 inches long. She is black with pale yellow stripe. Later, her stripes will fade away. She has bony plates on her back. Her legs, sides, and belly are covered with smooth, horny scales. The little alligator is very hungry. She begins to wiggle toward the water. The mother alligator takes some of the babies to the lake. She carries them in her mouth. It is too long trip, but danger is all around. Otters, raccoons, snake, and birds are nearby. They like to eat baby alligator. The little alligator is lucky. She makes it to the water. Now she can eat lots of insects, snails, tadpoles, and fish. In about six years, when she is a big alligator, she will eat raccoons, snakes, birds, and turtles. What about people? Do alligators eat them? Most people are too big for alligators to eat. But alligators are not friendly animals. The alligator mouth is full of sharp teeth. When she loses a tooth, another will grow back in its place right away. She may have as many as 6,000 teeth in her lifetime. Her teeth are small now. But a grown-up alligator has teeth the size of arrowheads. Male alligators can grow to be 15 feet long. That is as long as a pickup truck. Now the little alligator is 6 months old. She is 1 foot long. She is a good swimmer. She can wave her tail back and forth. She also has webbed feet, like a duck. The little alligator can stay underwater for a long time. She can close her throat, nose, and ears. No water can get inside. She also can see in the dark like a cat. At night, the little alligator hunts for food. She hides from animals until they get close, then she snaps them up. Many months have passed. Winter is coming. Soon it will be too cold for her to stay outside. So she digs a deep tunnel in the mud. She will stay there until spring. Alligator are cold-blooded animals. That means that their body temperature changes as the temperature outside changes. Hot weather makes their temperature go up. Cold weather makes their temperature go down. People are warm-blooded animals. Unless you have a fever, your body temperature stays the same. Alligator are reptiles. They have scaly skin like snakes and long tails like lizards. The word alligator comes from Spanish word for lizard el lagarto. All reptiles are cold-blooded. Crocodiles are reptiles, too. They look a lot like alligator. But when a crocodile shuts its mouth, you can still see the big front teeth. This called a crocodile smile. Crocodiles live in many places in the world. 
Alligator lives only in two places the South United State and China. Alligator and crocodiles have been around since the time of dinosaurs. Scientists have found the bones of crocodile called Dinosuchus. You say it like this, Dinosuchus. Dinosuchus was 45 feet long. Its jaws were huge. It had teeth like daggers. It may have hunted dinosaurs. Not very long ago, hunters were free to kill alligators. Purses and shoes were made from their shiny, smooth skins. Now alligators are protected by laws in most places. But people still kill alligators because they are afraid of them. Maybe now that you know more about alligators, you will not be too afraid of them. Just be very careful.